it's your boy Big Big B and we back for another edition of Big Big Business. Today we hopping into the house of Parfums Vintage and we coming back with Pineapple Vintage Intense. All right guys, so here's your presentation. What I really think is very interesting about this box here is the artwork, fuck the artwork, fuck the box. All right, so here's your fucking box, all right? If you wanna buy this one and any other crush boxes, it's available on bigbigbusiness.com under fuck the box. All right, guys, so that's your official presentation for Pineapple Vintage Intense. The bottle is pretty much just like the other bottles from the house, whether it's Pineapple Vintage, Pineapple Vintage Intense, the Extreme, or whatever they, whatever else they got. It's the same goddamn bottle, all right? So you've seen one, you've seen them all. Let's hop into these notes. So the official note breakdown, you got apple, rose, jasmine, bergamot, patchouli, ambergris, vanilla, and of course, you got pineapple. I mean, it says it on the bottle. Now, since receiving this fragrance, I have been truly impressed with this scent. Now, full disclosure, they sent me this bottle per my request, but this has blown my mind because I had no idea it was gonna smell as good. And this shit is the shit. It's Bond.com. Not to be confused with Bond9.com. Now, in case you've been living under a rock or if you haven't been searching the YouTube forums and you don't know, Pineapple Vintage is Parfum's vintage expression, their take on the king of Ventus. And in my personal opinion, this is a pretty close clone. Now, in past videos, we talked about similar fragrances, two Aventus that had similar DNA. We talked about bondnumber9.com. We talked about Sense of Peace for him. We talked about AB Silver, and we talked about our Mars Club, then we intense man. But this one is the closest by far, in my humble opinion. And again, I'm just a guy. This is the closest one Parfums Vintage has done a great job and they knocked this one out the park. To me, this is a classy and sophisticated scent. It comes off smoky, it's sweet, but it's not overly sweet. To my nose, it smells natural, it is not synthetic, it doesn't have that synthetic note or, or smell that you get in those other Creed clones or Aventus clones to be specific. This one is a pretty close copy and it comes off extremely natural, at least to my nose. In terms of performance, I say you get between eight and 10 hours on this one easy. Now my oldest son likes to grab this one a lot. I let him wear this to school often. He's 11 and he has, uh, what is that, PE. He has gym every day and he goes to school and comes home when he wears this and you can still smell it. Even after all that little kid sweat, it's still there and it still smells amazing. Now just as a little side note, when he wears this to school, he said teachers and Kids have told him he smelled good. Now when the teacher's telling you smell good, baby, them grades are gonna come on up. Now I've personally gotten a lot of compliments when wearing this as well, um, whether it was to work, um, whether wearing it to the store, even Home Depot. I wore this to Home Depot early one morning to pick up some stuff, and the lady at the self-checkout was like, sir, you smell good. Now she was old, but she still thought I smelled good. And at the end of the day, that's all that matters, baby. That's all that matters. Now you guys out there know my motto, my mantra. If you can't afford Ventus, save up and buy Ventus. But this one, this is the first one that's made me say, hey, look, if you can't afford, if you can't afford Ventus, then go out and get this. I've been told people that on um, Snapchat, etc. So this one is a pretty close copy. If you're looking to get something for the holiday season, I'll link it below. I don't get nothing on this besides this bottle that I already got. I'm just trying to put y'all up on game. This is some good shit, alright? I'm your boy. I wouldn't do you wrong. Price point on this one is $95 for 100 ml and it's clear with my pleasure of this fragrance that the $95 is well worth it. It's a lot less expensive than Aventus and for those untrained noses out there who no, no difference. Won't be able to tell a difference on this one. I think, uh, in my personal opinion, depending on your batch that you have, this is probably gonna be like between 95 and 97% similar to Aventus, and in that case, just buy it. All right, save yourself some money, buy it, unless you just wanna say, I got the key, Aventus, then just get that. You'll be good to go. Now, I personally believe you can wear this one all year, um, whether spring, summer, winter, fall, any occasion, this one is good to go for me. Now, if you're going on a date night, I would possibly say save this to round two or three. Just in case your date's not a big fan of fragrances, 
before you bust this one out. Besides that, it's good to go on my books. I'm your boy, Big B and B. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend, and tell a friend we back again. And all my vintage subscribers, go and tell new subscribers that we need some people in this community. Well, here you go.